Gorham from Bullionite. Thank you for joining me on another market analysis session. In today's session, I'm going to go over some of the major fundamental events that have happened in the last few months. As you have noticed, I'm sure if you're in the markets or if you're watching the news, you know that we've had a very heavy load of fundamental events that have taken place in the last few months. And I want to kind of go over the important events that you need to get an understanding of and be prepared for. And then I'm also going to focus on what markets did these events affect? Because as you know, fundamental events can have a broad effect on many markets. But if you really focus your lens and you start looking at where did you have the biggest effects from these fundamental events, then you can find some great opportunities to profit from, which is something that I want to cover. Okay, so first let's look at what are the major fundamental events that we should be concerned about and we should be knowledgeable about. The first major thing is after a having a kind of sequence or cycle of meetings, the Federal Reserve, where they raised interest rates over the last you know, couple years, for the first time they reduced interest rates in their last meeting, which is a you know, it could be a way of them letting us know that they think that there could be a slowdown in the economy, but I think there's more to that, okay? So here's what's important to understand about that Fed move. The important thing is not that they reduced interest rates, but the important thing is how many times more are they going to reduce interest rates? Like what's their schedule like now? Because with anything to do with the Fed and interest rates, it's what we call Fed speak. As, as traders and investors, we look at something called Fed speak, which is what they're willing to do next. Okay, and all of the um, speculation comes on. You know, are they going to re reduce interest rates at a much excel uh, at a much higher rate, or are they going to just keep it steady at a certain level? So this is something to watch out for because this has affected major markets like the US dollar market, the gold market, and we want to kind of analyze that. The next thing is we have to look at the trade war that's going on between the United States and China. What does that mean? How much of an effect is it going to have in the markets? And we'll dissect that. The other thing is, right after this whole trade war issue kind of escalated with Trump coming up with the additional 10% tariff on, on, on goods, China devalued its currency. Now, what does that mean? Because China has kept its currency steady at seven to one to the US dollar for the last 11 years. And this is the first time that they let their currency slip past that seven level, below the seven level. Um, that's a major thing. Why is that important? Because over the last year or two, a lot of Chinese companies um, have been borrowing money offshore from China, right? Now, what does that mean? What that means is that they are now having to pay back those loans that are denominated in US dollars, but they're having a local currency that can continue to go lower and lower against the dollar. Now, I'm not saying that it's gonna happen right away, but that's a big problem. And that could be a major ripple effect around the world and into our markets. So we need to understand that. And we'll, you know, it's with the, you know, the sequence of videos and more videos that I'll be doing, we'll get into that more. But pay attention to that. How is the Chinese government and how is China working with the US or in the global arena when it comes to their currency? Uh, plays okay, um, and then the last fundamental event that I want to focus on, and, and in, in more videos we'll focus on, is the election year that's coming up next year. That's a big deal. I've been through three change of guards in the U.S. presidency over the last few years, um, and we've looked at how those markets can affect. Uh, sorry, those if, uh, those political events affect the markets as a whole. So we want to be prepared for that, right? So these are the major fundamental events, the Federal Reserve, the currency devaluation by China, the trade war that we have going on with the United States and, and China, and then um, the election year that's coming up. Now that's big, and that's not all of it. That's, that's, you know, I've mentioned four major ones, but there's more, but these are things to watch out for. Now here's the other part to this equation. Not only do you have to be knowledgeable about the fundamental events and how they are unfolding, 
But you also have to understand which markets do these fundamentals event, events affect? And how big is the effect? For example, in the gold market, we've seen a major price movement because of these events. In the crude oil market, we've seen a major price movement, and in the equity markets. So what I'm gonna do is in, in the subsequent videos, and so you know, expect this from us because we wanna make sure that everyone is helped the right way, um, I'm gonna do a deeper analysis of these particular markets. The gold market, we'll look at the charts, what happened, how did the price move, where are we relative to last year, and, and kind of get a bigger, a bigger picture idea like a bird's eye point of view these will do the same thing with crude oil deeper analysis what's crude doing where is it going what has happened because of these events and then we'll look at the equity markets okay because this is what I believe most people and most investors are in some fashion or form exposed to these markets in some kind of an instrument, whether it's in the stock market, whether it's in an IRA, whether it's in a 401k. So if you're a hardworking um, individual and you are concerned about your money and your investments in the market, it is very important that you follow our video series and follow these fundamental events and the technical analysis that we'll come up with because I believe that there are great profitable opportunities that come from these events, plus, you can find ways to protect yourself from taking massive losses as these fundamental events um, kind of escalate, okay? Um, so be ready for those videos. I will put my time and effort and, and, and do my best to do a great analysis of these markets. Um, and again, you know, until next time, happy and successful trading and investing, and I will see you next time, okay? Content is for educational purposes only. This is not investment advice from Bullionite LLC. There is always risk for substantial losses in investing and or trading through any financial instrument with or without this or any other type of advertised product. Past performances are not indicative of future results. Different types of investments involve varying degrees of risk. Specific strategies or education presented by Bullionite LLC and its associates in this video are for educational purposes only.